Spend enough time looking for wild creatures in and around your backyard and you may notice signs of life, like burrows and holes. Though many creatures can burrow in lawns, most of these are invertebrates or insects. And during mid and late summer, there's a particularly beautiful and common beetle that you may encounter burrowing or emerging from burrows in your lawn. So I've been chasing these little beetles around this yard here. There's, this just goes to show you, there's all kinds of cool things even in your backyard, your local neighborhood. And these green June beetles, uh, though they may not be everybody's favorite beetle if you have a garden, because the larva can sometimes damage the roots of ornamental plants. The adults sometimes feed on fruit. Uh, they are a cool native species that's pretty common even in uh, even backyard settings like this. And what's going on right now is these really pretty bright green females are out uh, looking for a place to lay their eggs and they love this kind of sandy soil so that they can dig down lay their eggs and the larva will then grow up over the next few months to a year and emerge next year as these beautiful emerald green scarab beetles as you can see i'm not being bitten by this beetle uh, their mouth parts really aren't, I mean, they have mouth parts. Maybe they could give you a tiny pinch, but nothing painful. Uh, these are not biters. They have kind of spiny legs, so you might feel that. But they are not a, a beetle that you really need to worry about hurting you in any way. Watch closely for the female green June beetles as they fly swooping circular patterns low around your lawn. And then when they land, pay attention as they burrow into the loose soil and dig deeper to find a good place to lay their eggs. Though the adults are relatively short-lived, the larvae, or grubs, can live for months underground as they grow. Though these larvae can disturb the soil and plants a little while burrowing, they don't actually feed directly on live plants. And in captivity, these grubs have even been observed eating the larvae of more destructive, invasive insect species. So this beetle is both beautiful and potentially beneficial to have around in your backyard ecosystem. <laughs>